Now, the government has been urged to invest in grassroot football in order to tap into talents. According to Extreme CEO Hussein Mohammed, who attended a football tournament in Kitui County, the only route to be amongst the best footballing nations in the world is through having proper grassroots structures. We had purpose to engage our local youth through this tournament so that we can educate them and uh, highlight issues that affect their lives in terms of economic empowerment and financial literacy and also the doping and anti-doping menace so that they can know the value of shunning away from uh, drugs and substance abuse and one way of getting uh, this multitude of youth and even the homogeneous composition of the locals is through sports. We cannot keep on denying our young people where the opportunities are. We cannot keep on uh, denying our referees chances to grow what they have trained to do. We can't keep on denying our job coaches to practice what they have been taught to do. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm calling upon that we release one another for the betterment of soccer for people of Kitui and Kenya at large. The moment uh, the, the, the private sector sees that uh, there's integrity and there's accountability and there's transparency in how we organize ourselves at the grassroots, you will see the investments coming in. Today they ask themselves, if we put in one shilling into football, what is the value that we extract out of it? And unless we can quantify that value, unless we can show the corporate world that there is a benefit in supporting grassroots football and football in general, we will not be able to achieve, to achieve our full potential. To German